Hey everyone, how's it going? In today's fun video, I'm going to be showing you how to draw a mermaid surprise fold. So hope you follow along and enjoy this video today. Now to start off with our mermaid surprise fold, let's begin by folding our paper. So I'm gonna take my paper and I'm going to line up both corners and I'm just going to give it a nice fold right down the middle. Next, I'm gonna take this and I'm gonna fold it one more time, line up the corners again, and I'll give it another nice fold right down the middle. Now when I open this up, I have these nice little guidelines that show me where I need to keep the inside of my drawing. And I always like to turn my paper this way so I can open it like this. Now to start off with this, let's begin by drawing the top of our mermaid. So I'm going to start right here, and I'm just going to begin by making a nice, big, smiley face shape right here. Next, starting here, I'm going to draw a little line that comes up. And then right here, I'm going to draw a little line that comes down and up, and then down over to here. Now right inside of here, I want to make a little kind of cute face. So I'm going to begin by making a circle for an eye. I'm going to leave some space, and then I'll make another circle for an eye right over here. I'm going to make a little circle and then color in the rest of it. And then same thing, little circle and then color in the rest of it. Then I'm going to make two little lines on each side for some eyelashes. Then I'm going to make a little line across for a mouth. And then a line that comes down and up. I'll make a little line across for the tongue and then just color this part in. I'll draw a line on each side and then I'll bring that line down for the ears. Now before I do any more of the hair, I wanna work on the body a little bit. So I'm gonna begin by drawing a line that comes down on each side. Then I'm gonna bring this line down, I'm gonna curve it around and back up to here. Now starting here, I'm going to make a couple little bumps right around here for a little bit of detail. Now for the tail, I'm going to draw a line that just curves over. And then I'm just going to curve this right back up. Starting here, I'm going to draw a line that comes up and then back down. And I'll draw another one here. I'll just kind of curve this around and then right to here. And then I'll add three little lines on each side for some details. Now, starting up here, I'm just going to make a line that's just gonna curve around like this. And then I'll make another one here. It's just gonna curve around just for the top of her suit. And then I'll make a couple of lines in here so it kind of looks like there's some shells. Then we'll do a dot right here for her stomach. Starting here, I'm gonna draw a line that's gonna come out and then curve around for an arm. And then I'll do the same thing here, just curve out and bring it back for an arm. Now I can work more on the hair. So I'm going to begin by just drawing a line that's just going to curve up. It's going to come around and down like this. I'm going to bring this out and then just make a couple little pointy lines right here. And then same thing here, I'm going to bring this down and then just make a couple little pointy lines. Then I'm gonna draw two little lines in here for some eyebrows. And then I wanna draw a little crown on here. So I'm gonna make a little line that's just gonna curve around here. 
And then I'm just going to make a couple little points on here. Now, once we have our first mermaid drawn, then we want to open this up and draw the inside. Now, once we open this up, we have two halves. We have part of our mermaid up here and then part of our mermaid down here. So I want to begin down here. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to start by just bringing this body up here like this. Then starting here, I'm going to draw a line that's just going to curve down and back up here. Starting here, I'm going to make a little line that's going to curve down. And then a little line that's just going to curve right across here. Next, I'm going to bring this up with a few more points. And then I'm just going to bring this around and over here with a few points and then connect it. Now, right here, I want to make her kind of laughing. So I'm going to draw a little line. It's just going to go in and then back. And then I'll do the same thing here, just kind of in and back. We'll make a little curve for a smile. And then a line's going to come down and then up. We'll make a little curve line for the tongue and then just a little line right in here. Then we'll draw two little lines here for some eyebrows. Next, I'm going to make a little half circle shape on each side. And then I'm just going to draw some little circles for earrings. Now, right here, I'm just going to draw two circles for part of her bathing suit. And then I'll make a couple little lines here just to make it look like they're different shells. I'll draw a line that curves out and around here for an arm. And then one more is going to go out and then come back here. And then up here I want to add a little starfish in her hair. So I'm just going to begin by making a little point here. Two points on each side and then two more little points right here. Now the next mermaid I want to draw over here. So I'm going to begin by making a line that's just going to curve around and then up here. And then starting here I'm going to make kind of like a wavy line here and then a wavy line right here. Then I'm going to draw a line that's going to come up and it's going to curve down. And then a line right here is just going to curve for part of the body. I'm going to make a couple little bumps right here. And then I'm going to draw a line that's just going to curve out and then come back for the tail. I'll make a little line that's going to come up and curve back. And then one more comes out and then curves back. And then this time I'm going to make a couple little curve lines right at the tip of the tail. Now, starting here, I'm going to draw a line that's going to come up and then curve back for an arm. And then one more here that's going to curve out and then come back. This time, I'm going to make kind of like a winky face. So I'm going to draw a little line that's just going to curve in and then back. And then I'll make a circle here with a smaller circle inside of it. And I'll go ahead and color that part in. Then we'll make another little curve line for the mouth. And a little line is going to come down and up. 
with a curve across for the tongue, and then I'll just color this part in. Now, starting here, I'm gonna bring this line back up here. I'm gonna make it kind of curvy. And then I'm gonna make a little curve line like this, so it's kind of like a headband. Then I'm gonna make some long, wavy, curly hair that just kind of goes down here. And then some more long, wavy hair that just is gonna go back here. I'll make two curved lines right here for her suit. And then I'll put two lines on the side here. I'll do a little dot for the stomach. And then I'm just gonna draw some little wavy lines right here on the tail, just for a little bit of detail. And then I'm going to draw two little half circles for some ears. And then on this side, I'm gonna make a couple eyelashes and then I'll put a little line above each eye for some eyebrows. Now let's finish the mermaid that we had on top. So I'm gonna begin by drawing a line that's just gonna come down and it's gonna curve around for the body. Do a little dot for the stomach. And then I'm just gonna make a few little bumpy lines right around here for some detail. I'm gonna bring this line down. We're gonna jump over. I'm gonna curve it up and bring it back here. I'm gonna make a little line that curves out and in for the tail. And then another one here. And then I'll make some more little lines coming along the tip of the tail here. And then on this one, I'm actually just gonna put some big polka dots on here, just to make it a little bit different. So I'll put some big polka dots. And then I'm gonna bring this line down and this line down. And I'll just kind of connect it with a little zigzag line. Now, you can leave it like this or you can always add some extra things. Like one of the details you can add is I'm just gonna make a little curve line right here that just curves around. And I'll make a line that goes out, over, and back up. I'm gonna put two little black dots for eyes. And I'll make that same little fun mouth we've been making on here. I'll put a couple lines on here so we have a little clam there. Over here, I'll put a little starfish. I'm just gonna make a little line, it's gonna go up and down. I'll make another one out here and one out here. And then I'll make two more points right here. I'll put two black dots and just make that little mouth that we've been making. And then over here, I'll make a little fish. I'll just draw a little line, it's gonna curve around like this. I'll put a little black dot here and a little line that goes out and then down for a mouth. And then I'll kind of color that in. We'll make a little wavy tail on there and put a little curve here for the gill. I'll make a little wavy flipper and a little wavy line on top and a small wavy line on the bottom. And then we wanna add lots of little bubbles in here. So I'm just gonna add lots of different size little circles in here just to add some detail and make it look a little bit more interesting. And you can kinda of put these bubbles all over here. I'm just gonna add them in a few random spots. And there you go, there is your drawing of your mermaid surprise fold. When we have it all folded up, we have a simple little mermaid. And then when we open it up, we can see that's actually three mermaids with some of their little sea creature friends. And there you go. I'm going to fast forward and start coloring this. 
Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed.